you guys had another dream with um, Faze Rug and Bro Otis in it. What was that? Faze Rug's, I don't know if it was his house or what, but they were, he, he made like a huge fake airport. It was huge, tall as hell. And it wasn't working though, but it was fake. And um, he had a small airport next to him. It was working. It was running. And Bro Otis came over. I'm missing parts. I don't remember everything. Um, Bro Otis came over. He told Bro Otis to help me with my YouTube channel. I kept trying to get his attention to help me with my channel, but he wasn't taking it serious at all. Like he didn't. He didn't care. And. Um, Something else. There was weird technology in their house or wherever he like brought us or showed me around. There was stuff that I'd never seen before. The only one I can, one of the only ones I can remember is um, this thing. It looked like light neon colors. It was flat. And it was like a CD, the newest form of the CD players, of the newest form of the music. And he talked into it like he pressed, he did something in the air, like he pressed something in the air and he went, uh, like he said some kind of noise and he went inside of this, I don't know, it was not, a, I don't know why I would call it a machine or what, what the hell, but he, he went inside this thing, like it's absorbed him, I don't know what the hell, this, I'm telling you what I saw, <laughs> and so he went inside this thing and then uh, I was trying to get him out, so, you know, I'm trying to get my YouTube channel back up, you know, you know not back up, but, uh, help me with it. I, I pressed something, and then he, he jumped from one of them to another one, like, neon thing. But, um, those other people in the dream, I can remember their faces, but I don't know who they were. And other people, random people kept showing up in the dream here and there. I didn't know who they were. But, yeah. Let me think, tell me what you think in the comments. Like, subscribe, and share.